semis over the last uh, couple of weeks there at uh, Gawler. So their final tonight of the Gawler produce. But this is race two here at Mount Gambier. And the late male is number eight, Jan Starr. The favourite is Outlaw Dave. He wears the green rug if you're looking for him. They're set to run. Ready, racing, spearing out here, Yuba Beal and Outlaw Dave began fast and out wide was Jan Star. Outlaw Dave takes the lead. Now gets a length on Jan Star. the inside Yuba Beal, running on was Vectus Campanay, then what a buzz, and out the back were both Graceland Bound and Conjure Like, the leader. Outlaw Dave uses plenty of the track and Jan Star took the run, wide out, Vectus Campanay swallowing them all up though. Vectus Campanay over the top wins. Outlaw Dave and Jan Star in a photo for the miners from what a buzz. Uh, then Yuba Bill, Graceland bound and last in conjure like. That's a good win. Victor's Campanay over the top. Right over the top, down the centre of the track. Gee, $7 on the Ubet tote. Big price. For uh, Judy O'Neill, was about $3 on the fixed markers prior to the race, and it's paid $7.70 on the Ubet tote. Victor's Campanay down the centre has swallowed them up to win. From uh, Outlaw Dave, who wanted to use plenty of the track. And number eight, third, Jan Starr, who just got tired on the run. She was poking through along the rail, and the top of the straight, you probably thought she was going to win the race, but she's just faded to run third. And what a buzz gets fourth, number three, 23.75, the run. It's a length of winning margin.